actually Slash, he put me into a sober living. At the time, I wasn't even a, an addict, though. Uh, he put me into a sober living, and I just, I was sharing a room with, like, three other people in a tiny room still. Like, there was, like, 20 people in one house, and yeah. I was, dude, like, why am I even doing this? Like, like I'm not an addict. I don't relate to any of these people. Why, sh- why am I here? All I do is just smoke weed and like drink sometimes. You know what I mean? Like just like every other like person like my age, you know? Even though you felt like you weren't an, a true addict yet, do you think it was slash? I mean, that's something that is, I, if I didn't have my therapist tell me you had to go, I don't know if anybody would have told me, you know, you have to go to a rehab thing. Yeah. Slash to do that, I think... It, I don't know. I, I think that's a big deal. That says a lot that he cares about you, even though if he didn't feel like it. Because I said no to therapy at first. I said no to medication. I kept saying, no, no, I'm not these things. Only right. to find out I am these things. Yeah. I believe it at the time when he put me in the sober living, he saw something that like it. Some, some, it would, I mean, I definitely wasn't an addict at the time, but he saw maybe like, from stuff that's happened with himself that it happened to me too and he wanted to like help before things got out of control you know but i in my opinion i feel like you really have to just be ready to go through it yourself until you realize that you um until you realize that you need help you know what i mean